Hi, I'm Sean, and welcome to another episode of Bus Talk on the Road. Today we're at Montgomery County Public Schools to talk about how Highland supports MCPS's daily EV operations. Bus Talk. Hey, Stephen. Hey, Sean. Today I'm here with Stephen Johnson, one of Highland's field technicians here in Montgomery County. So Stephen, how do you support daily MCPS EV operations? Uh, definitely, um, I like to think of myself as like the ear and the hand um, of MCPS. I uh, basically kind of um, support the mechanics as well as the drivers, checking buses and chargers, um, supporting the depot managers, also supporting the depot managers with um, any concerns they may have, whether that be you know, technology or software advancement. It's a, a lot to do. Yeah, it's a lot. It sounds like the buses are coming back from the morning route. Do you want to walk me around and show me what you do? Yeah, let's go. Let's go. So Stephen, when you first get to the depot in the morning, how do you start your day? Uh, my day usually start with a dashboard and getting um, a list of information of buses with a low state of charge. Um, I then walk the depot, um, verifying those buses are mm -hmm. either charged um, or in session to be charged um, and making sure they're ready to go. Um, from there, I go to the depot managers just to check in and see if they have any personal concerns that they want to bring up, um, you know, in the, in the meeting calls, anything like that. I, then I go check in with the mechanics. Um, I may have some buses from them that I may have found, you know, with like that need to be jumping so forth. Um, but I'd also then check in with them to see if they have any concerns. Um, then I could just continue on to the next depot. Reliable charging is a huge part of running an EV fleet day to day. Can you go into a little bit more detail about some of the things that you're checking on the chargers and the buses? Um, just basically verifying that the charger is actually working. Um, a good thing to look for, um, you will see here, is the charger is blinking white. Um, just basically means that it's charging. Yep. Um, then you will walk over to the charge port and verify that it's charging as well. Um, from then on, I would just go down the line and verify which chargers are in session, which ones are ready to go, um, and make sure they're good for the drivers. And are you checking things like cords, physical condition, things like that? Yes, it's that, that's part of maintenance, um, making sure that the cord is in good tech. Um, charge holders, um, they tend to, you know, deteriorate sometimes over weather. Now that you've told us a bit more detail about what you're doing day to day to help support MCPS, what are some of the things that you've been working on with the MCPS team to simplify daily operations? Uh, training, um, making sure that the drivers are informed and understand how the chargers operate, um, mainly sequential charging. At MCPS, these chargers work on a shared bank of three, um, which means that one driver charges at a time. One driver plugs in and then the following driver plugs in. That driver would charge after the first driver finished charging. And also on this, making sure that the mechanics understand how the sequential charging works as well. It's clear that a big part of day-to-day -day operations is working closely with the entire team here at MCPS. What's one of your favorite moments that you've had with MCPS staff? It's definitely working with a driver. Um, this driver would call me every morning at 6.30 just to get the state of charge of her bus, you know, because she couldn't read the dash. Um, and now when I see her at the depot, she gives me a thumbs up and she's good to go. So Steven, I think we've really learned today how important it is that we, we work together as a team and we collaborate to have smooth and successful daily operations yeah. and to have yeah. fun together and, yes. and to, to do this important job of moving kids twice a day safely to and from school. Yes. Uh, normally I do the outro. Do you want to do it today? Uh, thanks for watching. <laughs>